if you are an out-of-state investor traveling the land looking for that illustrious cash flow, you are not alone. Cash flow is what we do, and we do it in the most efficient way possible. I'm going to show you how to get better than Pure Turnkey. What? Yeah, that's right. Pure Turnkey, it's out there. It's there. It's available, but you know what? You're leaving money on the table when you do Pure Turnkey. I'm going to show you the most efficient way to invest out of state. Let's go. This is your show. This is the show where I work for you directly, taking your needs. I'm going through the MLS, and I'm trying to find the best possible deal for you guys. Put down 25%. That's the perfect way to buy this. That's why real estate investing is the greatest industry in the world. Welcome to the show, folks. I am James Wise, and I am here for you today. Today, I am working with my man, Chuck. Chuck, you are an out-of-state investor. You've been partnering with Holton Wise for quite some time. Why? Because the market you live in, it's too expensive. Uh, the landlord-tenant policies aren't making any sense for you. And the inventory is too tight. You're not able to find anything that cash flows, that wets your beak, right? Your money can go much further in some of these cash flow markets, right? If you're out there watching and you're not Chuck, you may be running into some of those same situations, right? It's a very similar story that a lot of people have. Now, here's the thing. A lot of you people that have that story, you're usually only able to do one thing if you invest out of state, and that's go with a pure turnkey provider. They find a distressed house with equity. They buy it, capture the equity, renovate it, put a tenant in it, and then sell it to you at a premium. You're like, hey, man, I'm out of state. This is the only thing I can do. I understand I probably overpaid, but what else am I going to do? That ends today, folks. With me, what I do is I give you the turnkey services with my company after the fact, but we go out together as a team and we find properties on the market so you can get the best pricing. And I've been doing that with you for a while, Charles. And today, I have a property you saw. You're like, yo, dude, I think this one will make sense, James. Give me your thoughts on it. Should we do this deal? And I happened to actually look at this deal about a week ago for someone else. They ended up not doing it, but I do think it's a pretty sweet deal. I think it's going to make a lot of sense. I understand why you picked it out. So without further ado, Charles, let's take a look at that footage, run the numbers, and then you let me know if me and you are going to team up and take this sucker down. <laughs> Welcome back, folks. Let's pull up the numbers. This one, this one's going to have a war. All right, this one is war. This is war! This one's war, folks. War! You got to fight for this one, okay? Because it's priced uber good. 90 grand. 90 grand, y'all. Four days on the market. 1949 East 30th, lower rain. 90 grand, okay? It's too low. There's going to be a fight for this one, okay? You got a bit above list price, all right? You want to bid 90, you ain't getting the house. You want to bid 85, you ain't getting the house. You know what I'm saying? That's how it is. That's the way the cookie crumbles, right? It's nothing like amazing or anything like, man, this is the worst picture. Like, what What the hell? Why did the listing agent take this picture? I don't even understand why this. Anyway, that doesn't really matter. Like, here's the deal. It's nothing like amazing, nothing, nothing special, okay? It's just your regular run-of-the-mill duplex, right? The pictures, it looks like a regular duplex, okay? You can more or less come to the Cleveland market, the Northeast Ohio market, and find duplexes priced around $100,000 uh, that will look similar to this, okay? But this one, this one's better for a couple reasons. Not what it looks like. I mean, that's what it looks like. This ain't super sexy investing, folks. You ain't buying the Ritz-Carlton for 90 k okay? But this one's got some differences. One, the price, 90 k it's like 10k less than uh, you'd normally see. If this had a Cleveland proper address, it'd probably be like 115, 120k. Honestly, uh, this is in Lorraine, 1949 East 30th, Lorraine, half hour or so west. All right, I love Lorraine. I think Lorraine is awesome. Lorraine is a city and also a county. Right, Lorraine City is a county, or is it, Lorraine is a city in the county of Lorraine County. Lorraine. This property's in Lorraine City, which is also in Lorraine County. Does that make sense? All right, Cuyahoga County is where Cleveland is, and then you have the city of Lorraine, which is in Lorraine County, right? I really dig Lorraine County right now. 
I think the pricing is better in Lorain County and in the city of Lorain than it is in Cleveland, even though the housing stock and the tenant bases are about the same. In addition to that, in the actual city of Lorain itself, which is located in Lorain County, uh, we're getting some good stuff out there, right? They're building uh, two big naval bases in Lorain County, one of which in the city of Lorain, so both of which going to affect this market. We're looking at three or 4,000 uh, new jobs for these like shipyard naval base things. I will link the article in the show notes below, right? So I love seeing big things like that happening, okay? That's one reason I really dig it, the locale. The second reason I really dig this one more than anything is because the bed bath count is a 3-2. Each one is a 3-2. Normally, what we get are two ones. We are normally renting two ones, okay? With the three twos, our market rents, eight fifty a pop, seventeen hundred, right? Twenty thousand four hundred. Normally you see a lot of hundred, hundred fifteen thousand dollar two ones where the market rent is gonna be fifteen hundred. This we get those extra beds and baths, we get an extra two hundred dollars a month in cash flow, and it's priced less than a hundred K. So that's why I love this deal. This deal's awesome. Again, it doesn't look amazing from the photos, but that's not what you're coming here to buy, right? You're coming here to buy lower income rentals that work good for lower income cash paying tenants and section eight tenants, right? That's how we make our money, folks. That is what makes money. This chart right here, this is what you're buying. You ain't buying that goofy picture of the of the bathroom. You're buying the fact that this should kick off a clear NOI of $10,500 after having my company manage it for you, right? Now, as far as that price goes, like I said, 90 is too low. 90 is too low, okay? You ain't picking it up for 90. Sorry, wish you were. You ain't. I think we got to go 95. You go 95 on this, you put down 23,750. Bank kicks in the other 71. You're looking at a long term cash on cash return of approximately 30% on your money. Assuming we get uh, the, the units up to market rent, uh, which one is, you know, one is uh, very, very close. I got uh, <clears throat> one is super close. Uh, or one's already there, rather, at 850, and then the other one is, is a ways away at 600, right? You get this with mom and pop landlords. Sometimes they'll rent the stuff for below market value, right? That's the thing, though. You're working with me to provide you the turnkey services, right? So you're not buying from a traditional turnkey buyer or seller, rather, who understands the business. So they're not always going to wrap it up for you in a beautiful package, but that's okay, right? Because I provide you all those services after, and we're probably snagging a, a really good deal here because they don't know they could have uh, probably put a list price over 100000 and got that. So that's why we're going to come in quickly, snag it up, 5K over list, take this one down. It's not often you're going to find six beds and four baths in a Cleveland area duplex for this price. Let's go. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.